Uh, hello, uh, this is uh, Nick995. This is just a uh, new type of uh, series where I'm going to be doing um, walkthroughs, uh, game walkthroughs. So, part one, part two, part three, four, five, uh, so on and so on, you know. So, uh, walkthroughs. And again, uh, like I'm uh, recording this through my PS4, so it's going to be, some of it is going to be limited. So uh, the video is going to be shorter because my uh, memory stick, unfortunately, I can't hold a lot of, I got a free up space on the memory stick, so. But yeah, so this is going to be me uh, reacting uh, to the gameplay. And uh, Crash, and this is, and this is Crash Bandicoot 3. The uh, remake, the remake. So if you're watching this, like, subscribe, share the video. You guys know, press that uh, subscribe watermark down here. Please press on it. So yeah, Crash Bandicoot now, um, now the a third game is pretty easy. Like as you see here, like this is very very easy. This is a really easy game. It starts up very easy, right? You got your basic platforming. You know, jump over this. You got the frogs. This this frog in the way. This frog is annoying as hell sometimes, but he's slow. He's too slow. And he's that predictable. Same thing though, too. Like this guy, this medieval guy here. Like this, he just swings around like with the sword. They're pretty easy to avoid. Easy. And then yeah, so like. Uh, I'm going through it step by step. This is one. So I believe there's five different areas, and each area has five to seven different mission, different levels, right? So you do a uh, five times seven. What is that? A uh, thirty-five. So like th thirty-five different levels. So yeah. All right. And then this is a secret area. No, uh, no, I'm in a secret area. Pretty easy. Though. Very easy. I think this is the right. Uh, out of all the three Crash Bandicoot games I played, one, two, three, this is probably the first level where I got all the. There's the bonus, right? So like, if you get all the boxes, the boxes over here. If you get all the boxes, right? Uh, like in a level, now uh, you get like a white crystal. The white crystal acts as, as acts like as a bonus. Like, every level has that, right? Unless it's a level like where you gotta race, where it's a stipulation, it's a different type of level. So yeah. I wasn't even trying like that's so easy this level it's so easy uh, we're gonna see uh, as I, I play more of it the difficulty is gonna rank up you know it's gonna go up and then, yeah so I just picked up that uh, what do you call it again the, a, a purple pinkish uh, crystal uh, that's the main that, uh, uh, that's how you uh, progress in uh, crash 3 yeah I uh, see yeah, that's a white crystal easy 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 the crash 3 is so easy man he, uh, he got this little funny animation here. Yeah. But I wish I could add more like to the video. It's only like seven minutes. This, now this will only be like uh, seven to eight minutes. This is an underwater one. Okay, this is just part one. This is just part one. So two, three, you know, I'm, I'm gonna upload them frequently. I got the shark in the way. Get the hell out of the way. I wasn't sure if I could hit the shark. That's the thing. And you wanna no uh, the seaweeds or whatever. You gotta uh, go into them because they have boxes, right? You gotta get uh, the puffer fish. You gotta hit the checkpoint and the sea. The checkpoint box. That's like the most essential thing, right? If you don't hit the, the checkpoint box, you you know why you're screwed. That's the most essential thing. Checkpoint boxes and life boxes, the boxes that give you lives. Go down here, you gonna hit these. I thought it was like I thought it'd be like a chop in that uh, gold area, that golden area, chamber area. The sea, I almost forgot the sea. Went down now. Oh, this is a descent right it's pushing there's a wind that pushes you down so you can't get the boxes that's why it's hard to get all the boxes in this one and as you realize like i'm just stacking up on lives thing with crash 3 it makes it so easy to stack up on lives easily you could get because there's uh, tons of boxes right uh, you're not gonna die often it's easy the ai is pretty pretty uh, predictable and the uh, platforming is not hard at all taking out the seaweeds and Easy man, easy. I don't think I died once this this level. 
man. Nine lives. Nine lives. And already, and this is only the second level. Now, this electric field, if you hit the... You now, you're going to go on the non-electric non uh, electric side, and you're going to go this side. It's going to bring you down, and yeah. And going down, we gotta hit these. Oh, I hit this by mistake. So I did die one. So first death. A uh, first death. Can't talk. So yeah, pretty easy. Nine lives again. I'm back at nine lives. Amazing, eh? I forgot a life. I forgot a life back there. I didn't even realize I forgot an extra life back there. Because a lot of these I'm just in a rush to finish the mission, right? I want to finish the level. And that's level two, so pretty easy, easy. Now this next one is gonna get a little harder, and the video is gonna cut right, cause I had to split the video due to space and all that. I think I mixed up. I don't know. I don't know what I was doing. Yeah, I was trying to figure out which one is. And this one you gotta it's kind of like a race it's kind of like a race obstacle like you're racing through an obstacle right there's a tiger animate animation which is pretty cool now uh, the video is gonna cut soon and we're gonna go into part two oh, i died there yeah the barrels the thing with this though, the uh, animated, the, a tiger baby or whatever will move faster than you can react. Sometimes they'll hit the obstacle, the obstacle lab before you know it. Oh yeah, so that's it for this video. Like, subscribe, share the video. A part two coming out soon.